Hey YouTube, so I'm doing Goth to Kawaii Transformation and the look I'm creating is inspired by Decora Fashion. I thought it'd be fun to try out one of the more extreme and louder Kawaii styles. So let's start by wiping away the goth. So I've changed into wig, contacts, and an outfit you'll see more of later. So at this point I have on primer, concealer, foundation, and white on my waterline. Uh, check down below for products. Now I'm using Baby Bat Beauty Face Palette, and I'll be using the blush and contour from this palette, but a different highlight by Baby Bat Beauty. So I like to start by contouring. I'm using Starlight by Baby Bat Beauty to highlight. Now on to blush. Now I'm setting all that with Ben Nye Super White Powder. So now I'm using a Wet n Wild Pink Lipstick to draw on eyebrows. And now I'm using concealer to clean up the edges and just shape them a bit better. And now I'm using a complimentary pink eyeshadow to set them. So onto eyeshadow, I'm just packing on a bunch of pink eyeshadow all around my eye. Now I'm adding NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk to uh, open up my eyes more. Now I'm just touching up my highlight. Now I'm using NYX Liquid Liner just to do a simple cute wing liner. On to Mascara. Now I'm applying with these 302 lashes on top and a cute pair of bottom lashes. Now I'm using the same lipstick I used for my eyebrows on my lips and a pink shimmer in the center to highlight along with a gloss over everything. Onto accessories, so when it comes to decor fashion, shove as much cute shit on your hair and skin as possible. So I bought a pack of rainbow clips to just shove on as many as possible. And use some Lisa Frank stickers I had left over from the time I got really stoned and ordered a set of 600 Lisa Frank stickers because I'm not good at adulting. And I'm not sure why, but cute band-aids are a part of the fashion as well. And that's the finished look. Now let's talk about some kawaii habits. Pastel, pastel, and more pastels. Cute giant phone cases for mirror selfies. Cute plushy bags that can barely fit a phone. Convincing people you're not trying to dress like a kid even though some of your clothes come from the youth section. Facial stickers and jewels because even your skin needs to be kawaii. Asking whoever you're with to take pictures of you constantly so you'll have something to post online later. Overspending on cheap plastic accessories and collectibles. Wishing you hadn't thrown away all your Polly Pockets and Betty Spaghetti. Constantly taking selfies like this. Adding cute decadent pieces to your phone so it'll be adorable and twice as heavy. Importing eyelashes from Japan because they say dolly and you need a 10 pack of bottom lashes in your life. 
online usernames with the words princess, doll, and pastel. Music in their vlog that makes you feel like you're trapped in a Game Boy Color. Getting giant lollipops that you're never going to finish because they're better as props. Making sure even your underwear is kawaii. Pretending you're pigeon toed because it's cuter. Senpai, you should wear more color. No, and don't call me Senpai. Why? Neither of us is Japanese, neither of us speaks the language, and you're just a weeb obsessed with the anime. You're so mean. I'm not a weeb. Oh, really? What's your favorite snack? Pocky. Mm hmm. Favorite drink? Bubble tea. Crush at the moment. Kyoya Senpai, he's so cool. Can I see some of your art? Mm. And the results are in. Drum roll, please. Yep, you're a weeb. Whatever, Senpai. You should really work on that negative energy. Thank you for watching, like the video if you liked it, and subscribe if you want to see more from me. Bye!